Alright, uh, this will be a pretty short thing, this fairy will do. Uh, there's a couple things. Yeah, this thing. You basically get a, a lightning charge every, I don't know, it's hours. Let's go with this. And you use it while well, I'm out. So it's time to capture units. You can use a third party as well. They have a higher chance. And they just sort of like EMP bomb and carpet bomb multiple units at once. Uh, so yeah, it's basically just Pokemon. It's pretty RNG. One star is usually 100%, two stars usually 50%, three stars usually 25% capture rate. Uh, to upgrade this facility to get more charges to basically attempt to catch more Pokemon, uh, you just upgrade this thing. Uh, this is a stat swapper, I haven't really used it yet. Uh, so there's different growth stats, right? So they go from XS, S, L, M, L, and XL. And I think XL have the highest stat growth, that's how it works. And so what you sort of want to do is, like, once you get, like, enough units, it's like you want to, like, swap your, you know, XL growth rates onto, like, units you've already leveled or whatever, right? Alright, so this is this facility just gives you charges. More charges, more units, you can more attempts, right? Easy. Uh, this is skill trees. This is mainly for the ringleaders. Um, as you can see, there's, like, three things. So there's, like, night vision shit here. I could go to speed. This is, like, Um, in general, you can't mix, you can't mix Griffin and Songus. In general, from what I found, uh, Songus are pretty strong, but they're also pretty fucking expensive to deploy. Right now, I don't have enough armor units, you know, the good old armor units, so I sort of don't want to try to do that. Because they also want to do damage, you also have to do that. Like, that's what I mean, like, their deploy cost is high, and like, if they take damage, you have to repair them like any other unit. So. But like, the thing is, like, so for example, what is this, like, 4-3? Is it 4-3-E? Yeah. For example, like, you want to do the stage around, like, 50, right? I'm like, uh, Griffin? You can do this stage on, like, you can come in here at, like, level what? With Sagas? And you'll take, like, 3 points of damage to run, depending on your, uh, depending on what you got. So, like, like you sort of want the shield dudes. The shield dudes are good. They get, like, they actually just give shields to everyone. So, stay Okay, so they basically get it. Uh, I think, as of now, you have to watch the video every single time it goes off. Uh, so you can see the result of the skills Well, I haven't actually looked too hard at the odds of the player. I'm pretty sure you can. Uh, <laughs> You can't turn it off. So you have to see it every single time. Alright, these three buttons, formations, right? I don't really want to click them because I'm auto battling. But like, I want some forward formations, so if I press forward formation, it's just right? it's just basically like where you want. Oh, they have three types of things. Like they use separate things as well, right? They have separate things that let them so they have separate things that let them get more uh, experience. They have separate no dailies. No uh, data. Uh, data. Uh, 
最初に言った通りあなたたちはその結果になるしかないんですわ I actually don't know if they gain more experience the more damage they have. I don't think so. I'm more than guessing. Anyway, that's it for saying it's very. Uh, yeah.